Hey, you guys. We are finally here, and I'm going to be unpacking with you guys. This is the Mom More diaper bag backpack that I have bought and have fallen in love with. It is the diaper bag I've decided to go with. There are no returns on this one. There are, but there aren't, so... <laughs> we're gonna dive right in because pack a packing video can take a while and i'm gonna go ahead and go through all the diaper bag baby items because i won't have to do a separate video for that and i know that it makes it easier but it just makes the videos a little lengthier so let's get right to it in the front pocket is just one pocket i know it looks like two but it's definitely one pocket and i'm gonna show you why the bottom is just for getting short things out of here, but mostly I will have tall items. And this right here is just an easy access burp cloth. This right here is one of the baby items that I've recently bought. It's the Aiden and Anias brand. It's actually a burp bib. Look at this. Like, this is absolutely awesome, y'all. And when the baby gets bigger, you can wrap it around. And I even tried it on myself. Like, it would be so protective. I loved burp cloths when the girls were babies. And they're my favorite necessity. And this is so soft. And it has three layers. There's a layer in between, too. So, it's very absorbent from what I assume and from the reviews I've read. But definitely would consider buying more Aiden and Anias products. So, that's the burp bib. If you guys are interested, I got it off of Amazon. This right here is just some chapstick that was gifted at my clinic. This right here is my three-year-old's cell phone. It is not on, you guys. My husband just uses it for entertainment. One of the wisest things he could have ever done. I don't know where my five-year-old's is. Hers would be here, too. Well, she's four, about to be five. Y'all know what I mean. So, these right here are their snacks. They were on the inside. But I was like, okay, I want to realistically show them how I would pack this bag. I'm like an on-the-go. When I'm in the car, I want a baby snack. I'm thirsty. I want it to be very accessible. And having a newborn baby here in a little while is going to make that all the more uh, neat, a need. So, um, they're originally not the protein bars. Like These are really good because they have three grams of protein and can hold them off. We live off of those, y'all. The protein bars are more so for me. These are just some easy grab napkins. We may or may not use those. I promise you we're probably going to use the wipes. This is a key fob. This is so cool, so convenient because my van allows you to walk up to it. And when you get close, it unlocks the door. How awesome is that? So that would most likely stay in there unless I'm driving my Camry. And that is all. And this is how long it is. So basically, if I'm trying to grab something short... And it's a pretty wide bag. Even when the bag is full, it allows you to fit quite a few things in it. And I love that about it. So, that's what you use that short compartment for. This side, you guys, is one of my favorite compartments. It is the wipes dispenser. Not the current bag that I have, but the bag I had before that. It was a diaper bag backpack also. And it had the wipes dispenser, y'all. How convenient is it to just... I mean, come on, this was mine and my husband's lifesaver, okay? And you can't necessarily fit a full one in there. And I didn't break that off. I weren't ready for it yet, but I probably will most likely. And it'll keep them cool, so you don't got to worry about that. I'm pretty sure it would fit a Pampers um, sensitive container or Pure Wipes or whatever, but it wouldn't fit a whole one um, of mine. But I pretty much change them out um, for the most part. This right here is obviously... A bottle pocket it is not insulated uh, that sucks but it's probably one of the only things i wish i could change about the bag literally and i really don't even feel so much so crazy about that because i will be breastfeeding and pumping so if i put the bottle in there most likely he's going to need it in about three hours and you can keep them um, in good temperature without being refrigerated for about four hours or so so and it's really like, it's really spacious, y'all. I hope you guys can see it. This is my keychain, you guys. Oh, my goodness. Uh, I absolutely love it. I'll have to go into more detail about it. But this is my keychain. It says Mama Bear on it. Let me bring it a little closer for y'all. It says Mama Bear. And it has different letters on it. Um, for 
for baby Driggers, the D, um, and all the other initials. It is absolutely to die for. I love my keychain. I would have had it here, but it kind of falls over the zipper, and I didn't want it to be messed with a whole lot. So I put it on the side because this is usually where stroller straps go. I'm going to leave those there. And the other ones are on the inside where we're going to dive into in just a second. So the back is my other... I'm like my other favorite compartment but all of them are my favorite i absolutely love this bag y'all <laughs> um this is for my husband and myself i told you guys i wanted to start doing cubing if you've watched my other reviews i didn't have my cubing essentials yet because i hadn't bought them i was just kind of showing you guys how i pack and how you could pack from multiples so this right here is the diaper clutch y'all and i'm gonna go ahead and go into this one too this is from one of my favorite brands i finally bought something for them this is the jujube it's a little blurry let's see if we can there we go and it is the wet dry bag and it is i guess a large piece it's the largest that i got of the three ones that i get the three that i do get and it actually comes see how it comes with a little um clutch holder and inside of here i just have um Bordeaux's diaper cream y'all these are lifesavers my daughter's pediatrician is the medical director at her clinic he is absolutely awesome she actually just went and seen him today oh my goodness hadn't seen him in so long it was so refreshing just to hear from him and just get even more motherhood advice it was just awesome so you could probably fit a small thing of wipes in here i would used these up already so i stuck them in there three little diapers i understand they're going to get bigger so you may only be able to fit two so you have to be very consistent about um changing it out unless you're going to get a beer cube which i just can't see myself doing because i just packed so much and this right here guys oh my goodness used it for my my last daughter and i kept them and i've washed it it is by munchkins it is a wipeable um changing cloth you can put it over the changing pads at church or in a store and you can if he poops she poops you wipe it clean i put the, i used them on her changing pad that did not have covers on it um, that were wipeable, but not, but now we have a changing pad that don't need covers. But anyway, so this is for on the go, just so my husband doesn't have to, or me, don't have to pull out the diaper changing pad that comes in it, and it's awesome as well. This right here is the Ubby um, nappy bags container. I'm sorry, I guess it's Ubi Ubby. Not sure, but this right here, basically, you just. I had these for my other daughter, but they were like from Dollar Tree in the little box. And my husband would always destroy them. I could not stand it. So this right here is where you change it out. And this is where you pull the bags out. See how you can like turn it to get where you need to be. And they're they're kind of large bags, but, and then they rip off like that. So, and there's an Arm & Hammer one. They're both about the same price. I thought I would like the Arm & Hammer better, but I did reviews on it. Even after I bought this one because I was just going to buy the Armour Hammer because it's less bulkier. But they say it's hard to get the bags out. And compared to this one, as you could see, it was not that hard. So, probably going to keep that bad boy. <laughs> okay. So, we are going to go into the bag. And you guys are ready? And the zippers are just life. The shoulder pads are so thick, y'all. I mean, and they hold up well. And they're easy to maneuver. Look at that. There's no struggle whatsoever. I'm going to tell y'all how much this bag costs at the end. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Let's zoom up on that. Okay. I hope it was clear for you guys as I was reviewing. Okay. Inside of here is a little mesh pocket, if you guys can see. Right here's a little mesh pocket. This is the material on the inside. It looks cheap, y'all, but, I mean, what's more important? um wipeable clean or fashionable <laughs> material if you have multiples i'm like can i just wipe this thing now so and it's actually really cute i actually fell in love with it um this right here is a mesh pocket it actually has another clutch the jujube wet dry bags comes in three pieces so this is the medium piece i guess um and their material is just everything um they're really sturdy i love jujube it actually has a change of clothes for my three-year-old who still has accidents here and there more frequently than my um, four-year-old who rarely has them. Um, and so I keep that in there so that my husband doesn't have to dig through the clothes or myself when having to take her to the potty, change her, whatever the case may be. These are just 
um, accessories that I have in the bottom, H pair undergarments um, for my four year old, because like I said, she is not perfect either and she makes mistakes. Um, so right here is the swaddler. This is a Muslim swaddler. I have some other swaddlers coming by Copper Pearl. Um, that I've heard nothing but good about, but I actually st actually still like the Muslim swaddles. So I don't know, you know, people say they come out of them, but they're so huge. I don't understand how, but this would basically mainly be in his car seat or around him. So this is not necessarily going to always be in the bag, but as you can see, I did put it in there. I'm just showing you guys the, um, the capacity of this bag and how much it can hold basically this right here is another one of my baby items i bought i really love it you guys this come off of amazon it is so soft it is so soft it is a car seat cover which will mainly be on the car seat and it's a breastfeeding cover as well and i'll basically go into detail and show y'all how to wear it and all that good stuff and it actually has an extra burp cloth in there and also some nipple butter that i bought Let's see them up on it. It is the organic nipple butter by Earth Mama. I didn't use this the last time, but a friend of mine actually also bought me the organic Lanzano that I used last time, but it wasn't organic. It was just regular Lanzano. But I'm just like, the more I have babies, <laughs> I'm like, I need everything natural, healthy, like <laughs> safe. But that's, it's so soft, y'all. Like the, I'm not going to take it out, but that's the car seat cover slash breastfeeding pillow. If you want to put it on the cart at the store, put it on the cart at the store. It's basically like a five-in-one. It does other things as well. This right here is one of my favorite products too that I bought. And I was like, oh, kind of weird about it at first. I still wish it was a little bigger. It is called the Skip Hop Mom Hip Clutch. It's basically like a diaper clutch, but I don't use it for that. Because I know I'm not going to tote a purse and this. I would like to tote a satchel. But I'm so particular. I couldn't find anything that works. And this right here is just the closest thing. And the material is so good, y'all. I love Skip Hop. I don't know if you guys have ever shopped Skip Hop. But they're awesome. And inside of it, I wanted to have something that could fit my wallet. I, be, I see reviews and moms who have these little, like, coin purses. And things where they put their cards. I'm like, um, no. I need something with my cards in it. My receipts. My change. Like, my whole life life my id i need everything okay this just has some mom stuff um i i don't i'm not really i'm a minimalist when it comes to the makeup and all that good stuff so um that's actually just some listerine if we go somewhere and um desperately need it i basically wanted every I wanted something that would fit everything in case i need to pull it out and go to the bathroom at church or go to the bathroom anywhere else and just use whatever i needed um to freshen up a little bit so that's that these right here are some more accessories for the baby oh my goodness y'all this is another baby item i bought it is um an indie brand let's see if you can zoom up let's see it's the indie by kiss you baby and it is a bandana bib you guys but and it's so soft but it's reversible like i mean seriously come on it's reversible. So if they mess up one side, they can still look cute. <laughs> so that's that. I didn't really like the bandana boots for my daughter, but um, I read nothing but good reviews about them. So I bought them and I absolutely love them. I think I have like two or three. These are just some more hats um, because I know that it does, even though he's a summer baby, you keep them covered because their body temperatures have to regulate and it only happens over time. Um, you have to give them time for that. So I bought some, and this is, like I said, I might not put all this in there. Um, this here, I'm trying to downsize as best I can, y'all. And if you don't use these cups for your your kid, like, these cups are awesome. They do not leak, y'all. They're like $3 at the store. They come with, like, veggie juice or fruit juice in them. And I keep them, and I make sure I clean them with the dishwasher so they, like, are get really clean. Um, cause I'm like weird about cups that are not clean because they're, they can eat, con drink contaminants and that's not good. So, and this one is insulated. So this is also where his cup could go if I needed it to stay for longer periods. So I have that option. It's just less convenient, which is fine with me um, because I love the convenience of this, right? So these are more diapers. Again, I'm never going to tote a bag that has less than like seven, eight, nine diapers, especially in newborn stages, y'all. You want to have plenty of diapers. 
let me make sure you guys are zoomed up okay so or clear this right here is my medicine bag it's my last juju piece i don't know where my piece is for it um but this is the smallest one it's not the size i would like for it to be for a medicine bag and if i had to i would just buy another um another juju piece set in like the medium i'm more so like the um if y'all saw my other medicine bag, that was like almost done for. It was a little bigger. <laughs> but anyway, so a way I would downsize. I'm working on the overpacking, you guys. And, well, not working on the overpacking, but learning how to be smart in it. So I would get just get the travel size ibuprofen for my big girls. And then, obviously, it has a dropper in there for them, which I don't know where the other piece is. And this will be for the newborn. I don't know how I still kept these. And Lee's almost four. But anyway, I'll get newer ones. I was just showing you guys. This right here is a brush. I got this off of Amazon and I heard so many good things about it. Um, it obviously wouldn't work once, you know, the baby gets up in age because it's so smooth, but what baby brush isn't smooth. It's like made out of goat's hair and at first it smelled like a goat and it even like um, can be prone to shit if you pull on it, but I, I love it. And it's been in my smell good bag so much, I guess. It like don't even smell like that anymore. It smells like my bag, which smells really good. <laughs> So, this right here is just some um, Simply Saline, you guys. This is like a lifesaver, okay? Like, it saved my kid's life as a newborn. Don't take them babies to the doctor. If you know it's just a runny nose, they're getting used to being around the dry air and all that good stuff. Like, just, just give them some time. They're not going to give them a lot of medicine, so don't, you know, suspect that. And I'm not saying don't take them, guys. I'm just saying invest in that and let it help you. And a humidifier. Um, these are just some nail clippers that I've had since Lee was a baby. And they're smaller than the ones that I was gifted. So I'll keep those he here and use this on the go. Uh, thermometer, of course. So I have my grooming kit and my med kit all in one. I've always done that. And that's just how I like to have it. Just so it's not all over the place. Neosporin that my husband's actually been needing lately. Just keep that in there. I usually have my Bedrow diaper cream that I have in my diaper clutch in here as well, which I probably would put some in here. And you can also get a travel size in the Bedrow cream. You don't have to get one that big just to make it, you know, easy um, and keep the big ones for at home. I would do both. This right here. This right here is a Nalgene cup, another cup, another item I just bought um, for my daughter, um, who's about to be five. She's such a big girl now. She like wants the big girl cups. So I researched this one. They actually sent me the wrong one. So they're sending me one with the indents in it to make it easier for her to hold and my three-year-old who's about to be four because she's been wanting um, to move up to. They, they don't really like the sippy cups anymore. And I wish I could show you the sippy cups. I absolutely love, but anyway. So, and they say these are like, um, they don't spill, but I'm not going to try this one out yet because I'm returning it. So, I'm just like using it for the video. They're actually replacing it for me. Anyway, it's called Nalgene. Nothing but good reviews about it other than they say it spills. But, I mean, there's like no cup that's spill proof completely. This is the um, satchel, the satchel um, cord for my skip hop and it becomes a hit bag i'll just i'll wear all of those in another another video it's absolutely awesome y'all those are the shoulder straps this right here is a satchel piece if you need to like tote it around if you feel like you're gonna be walking around for a while and you're gonna be using one of those jujube bags more than usual um you would put it you know on the bag so awesome and i just basically keep those right there because i would never want to take the strap stroller straps out because i'm one to only have one stroller strap and be stuck and anybody got time for that this is a changing pad y'all it is so awesome and we're almost done here this here is oh my god it feels so good y'all and it is white clean i'm going to tell you now it's white clean material look at the little feet and it's a good size and it feels like such good quality like i didn't even see um i don't even see a lot of diaper changing bags that look like that and this is how far that goes down this right here comes out really far look at that like it would hold quite a bit like this would hold a lot more diapers than what it's holding these are all the baby's clothes the baby's clothes are on top obviously he'll be changing more then lee's are separate because she probably change um um a lot as well next to baby and then at the bottom are just my daughter's little change of clothes and lee's second pair of change of clothes which i will never take out <laughs> and i'll always keep that in there and last but not least 
So I didn't really take everything out, but I will. So you guys can see. So, and I love that this is here, y'all, because when you pull this down, look at how those zippers are. When you pull this down, it don't come out. With the Jujube Be Right Back that I was in between, it comes out. And when it comes to price, even down to quality, like, this beats it. I just feel like it does. So, and if you want to stand them up like this, you can. My husband's not going to do it that way. So, I'm just basically showing you guys how husbands think. Well, mine. So, look at, that's the inside, you guys. I mean, a lot of compartments. A lot of ways to organize this bad boy. And last but not least, you guys. Let's go ahead and take the clutch out of the back. I'll leave the wax in. Last but not least, up top is a sunglass holder. But I don't have that in there because I wanted to, I don't have my baby, my net passy clip, which will go on the side. You can buy an itsy ritzy one that holds two passies. But mine, I don't even know if my kid's going to take a passy. And as you can see, I haven't used it yet, I'm obviously. Um, but this right here, I bought off of Amazon too. It is a passy clip. They are so cute. Look at that. So, um, yeah, that would be cute for the baby and they're actually good quality i was looking at the i don't buy anything without looking at pictures first <laughs> there were videos or whatever because when buying online for a baby is it's hard but it's not really big so all you'd be able to fit in there is basically like some easy grab items um you could fit a burp cloth in there um aiden in a nice bib cloth is pretty big in size or some it's actually a good place for the snacks you guys my goodness anyway you get the you get the vibes so that is basically the mom more backpack diaper bag in black y'all it comes in two other colors and i'll provide a link for you guys too so you can shop it this bag was if i'm not mistaken 47 dollars and one of the colors is only 42 it might have been mine um there's a black one that has gray right here and then there's a black one that has um like a camel brown um, and then it has white right here. Um, but white is not for me with three small babies. Ain't nobody got time. So that's basically the mom more diaper bag backpack. It's absolutely awesome. I hope you guys took a lot from the video. I know it was lengthy. Like I said, I wanted to show you guys all the baby items. Um, so you could pretty much see what my baby essentials are. The only thing I don't have in here would probably be some, um, my hand sanitizer that I usually have desperately nowadays um hashtag COVID-19 <laughs> um is not in there and maybe one or two other things which I mean I can't even think of what they could be and like I said mainly um this wouldn't be in here or maybe this and not saying I'm going to take that many clothes I was basically just showing you guys how much this bag can hold it is so lightweight and on the bottom it has the um the shoes basically to keep it from being damaged so much because you know you're going to be laying it on the ground quite a bit um so yeah and that's how far my hand can go in back there um if you guys want to see me wear it i'll let you guys see what it would look like um wait worn this is what it would look like worn it's really cute right I'm so tempted to get the other colors, <laughs> for real. And if you use your Amazon registry, which I'll talk about in another video, this bag could be even cheaper. I mean, come on, 15%, like you just, you just can't beat it. And from the review I watched of a mom who's actually a mom of four, she said this bag holds up really, really well and she packs it just like I do, okay? It was so awesome that she was the only one I could find with a review on YouTube about it. So, I would say it's worthwhile, it's worth the buy if you're a backpack person, if you need something like this to save your life. And if you don't necessarily like the style of the bag, like I said, um, she has other products as well. I'm not really sure what the other bags look like, but that's our packing video of the Mom More diaper bag backpack all right you guys i'll see you in the next one bye bye